Hi guys, James here. So we're in our second week of looking at development of strength for getting your first pull up. Last week we looked at developing the muscular recruitment with negatives and this week we're going to be looking at developing more the specific strength for the pull up exercise. To do this we're going to be looking at assisted reps. So let's get right into the video and look at some ways that we can use assisted reps for the pull up. So guys, now let's look at some assisted variations of the pull-up. The assisted reps give us the advantage of taking some percentage of our body weight off the pull-up movement and allows us to progressively develop strength to do the exercise. In this first example, I'm using the classic assisted pull-up machine. Here, the weight acts as a counterbalance against my body weight. This is very effective because it will allow me week by week to actually decrease the counterbalance and thus develop the strength for the full pull-up. Our second method for developing strength with the assisted pull-up is to use some sort of dynaband or some sort of dynamic tension resistance to assist our body pull-up from the ground. In this example, I'll take the pull-up band and I'll wrap it over the bar secure it in position and now I can use it as a stirrup on my foot to actually suspend my body weight. This way it will help me at the hardest point of the pull up at the bottom driving up in towards the top and give me the assistance I need to develop strength in the assisted pull up movement. So guys, there we have some options for assisted pull-up variations that we can use to develop the strength we need for our first clean full pull-up. It might be that we need to be quite progressive with the uh, development of the strength for the pull-up and it's okay to take a slightly slower path with that so that we can develop the strength. A common, uh, common mistake that we can see made is to try too much at first to get one pull-up and sometimes a little bit more volume in assisted pull-ups can be more effective for developing more lasting strength. This ensures that our first pull-up is a clean pull-up and we can develop our strength from there. Guys, next week we will look at some tips for saving our grip in the pull-up exercise and how we can go on to develop our pull-up further. Thanks for listening. We'll see you next time.